Hi, I'm Gary Worthington. Today I'm going to show you how to get started airbrushing using Wicked Colors. What I've got here is I've got a big mouth bottle from Iwata. I'm going to pour some paint in there. We're going to reduce it a little bit and then we're going to get started. Basically, I'm going to take Wicked Jet Black. I'm going to squirt just a little bit into this bottle, not being concerned about any kind of ratio or anything like that. Taking a little bit of reducer. I'm going to pour that in there just to thin it out a little bit. Put my lid back on and we're ready to go with that. There are a lot of videos out there that show you the specifics of reduction, so I'm gonna skip over that. Now, Wicked is made to be used in airbrushes from any tip size from 0.18, like a Micron, all the way up to, say, a spray gun size. So it's very versatile. Now, the reduction is going to matter in terms of how small of a size tip you have in your airbrush and the PSI you're using. Wicked is recommended to be used at 35 PSI or higher. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna hook a quick disconnect into our airbrush hose. Now we're using the small end of the airbrush hose which is designed to hook directly to the airbrush. If you do not have a quick disconnect, hook it directly to the airbrush. But since I have a quick disconnect, I'm gonna show you that today as well. I'm gonna screw this in just like that. Now I'm going to take the big end of my hose and I'm going to hook that to my compressor. That's going to give me my airflow. Now we're going to take our airbrush, we're going to hook it into this quick disconnect just like that, that easy. We're going to hook the big end of the hose to the compressor. That's going to give us our airflow and then we're going to start painting. All right, now that we've got our paint hooked up to our airbrush and our airbrush hooked up to air, we can get started. What you're going to want to do is push down for air, pull back for paint and just get started. Just let that paint come out of that airbrush. See how nice and smooth that flows. So we got it reduced just right. We're good to go. And that's how you get started with Wicked Colors.